takes us on an urban camping adventure. Now that's what I'm talking about. The summer heat can really dry out your skin, so for a look at some beauty essentials, we throw it over to Susie. Hey, thanks. First up, in the style mailbag, we get a letter that reads, Dear Susie, do you have any beauty products for the summer that you want to let me in on? My face needs help. Love, Lara. Okay, first up, drum roll please. Burberry Beauty, the legendary fashion house, has launched a line of beauty and makeup products that is fabulous. Everything from rich neutral shades to deep, very fashion forward colors, smooth like butter. The pieces are inspired by the Burberry Trench and the moody hues of English weather. So pucker up and get lead to a whole run through. They are selling Burberry Beauty exclusively. Love this brand. Okay, next up, you got to wash off all the drama. After you've worn all your makeup, turn to a Canadian brand. They're 100% organic. They're called Consonant Body Organic. You will love how this stuff feels, everything from moisturizers to face cleansers. You'll also love how it looks. Love this blue and white kind of chic, simple packaging. You can stay hydrated. You can look fabulous right in the middle of summer. Go to ConsonantBody.com and you won't be paying La Luxe La Mer prices. Dig that. And lastly, what summer without a few seriously late nights out on the town? You've got to save your eyes, Lara. Turn to something by Elizabeth Grant. It's called The Socializer. It's basically a two-click pen. There's bright lights, which is a morning treatment, and late nights, which will erase all your sins from the evening before. It helps repair and awaken and depuff. Okay, and footnote, Blake Lively is a mega fan, and Susie Wall is now officially hooked as well. Lara, thanks for writing. Email me your questions at dearsusie at ctv.ca. That's it for me from the West Coast. We'll see you next week. Matthew Perry, Pam Anderson, Seth Rogen. Sure, they made it big with some hit shows, but now we round up a few casting what-ifs.